Hello again, everybody. This is Lynette with The Skin Candy. Thank you so much for joining us again today on another one of our Soapy Time adventures. Today is going to be a lot of fun. I'm going to be making a 25 pound slab of soap using the fragrance Blue Capri, Volcano Capri Blue type. This is by Aztec or Candlemaking.com. This is a very tropical scent. It has notes of mango and papaya and pineapple and anything tropical you can think of it would be in there. It is a beautiful scent and to go along with it we're going to be doing a lot of colors today. So there's going to be a lot going on. We're going to be doing five different colors today and I will admit I have never done five colors in a 25 pound slab before so most likely we'll do an in the pot swirl depending on how the um, fragrance behaves, which I'm going to assume that it's going to behave really well and make my batter really fluid. So the first thing I'm going to do is going to be making a really bright orange. Um, oranges and yellows tend to kind of fade a little bit in cold process soap. So I want these colors to stay really vibrant. So I'm going to be mixing Tangerine Dream and Cheese Poof, which is Mad Micah's um neon then i'm going to be mixing tennis ball breaker and taxi cab together and then the other one i'm going to be mixing together is tickled pink and voodoo so those are the three neons we're going to be mixing then to that i'm also going to be adding some Grape Knee High. This is one of our favorite colors. We use it all the time in just about every product we sell. So I buy it in the one pound container. So I don't have to worry about running out anytime soon. And then the last but not least is the Tahitian Teal by Mad Micas. All the links to the fragrances and the, and the Micas that we use will be in the description box below. If you haven't had a chance, go ahead and like and subscribe. Make sure that you hit that notification bell so that you can hear, you can find out whenever we upload a new video. For the top, before I forget, I wanted to let you know that I'm going to be, I'm not sure which one I'm going to do yet, but it, I'm going to be doing, using their Eco Glitter, the Sparkle Me Plenty, and or the Sparkle Me Blue. I thought that might be fun with the blue the volcano blue type fragrance oil to kind of tie all that in together. I'm not sure if it'll work or not. Um, we'll see. So like I said, we're going to be doing a in the pot swirl. And what I'm hoping to do is that what I would like to do is I'm bringing over my mold so I can kind of show you with my hand. What I would like to do is if I can is take the batter and back and forth, back and forth, and let it kind of swirl in to kind of make it a little bit of a, maybe of a clamshell swirl. We will see what happens. So we're working a little bit warm today. I am noticing that most of my scents that are citrusy um, are really going very loose. So I'm working at about 95 degrees today. Normally I work in the 80s and yeah, my, my lye water is at 95 and my oils are at 93. So we're going to use the big stick blender for this batch just to get started and then we'll use the smaller stick blender once we get going with our um, colors and splitting off. So we'll go ahead and get started. Mm -hmm. 